Hey guys, hope you're doing great. Uh, welcome to our channel Gurukul and today we would be creating copies of a file on a Windows machine. So creating copies of a file is a very practical use case that you would be coming across in the organization. So let's say that you have a data entry form and you want to collect uh, lots of data from the users. So for that, what you have done is you have created a main template form of the data collection file. Now you want to create copies of it, transfer them to all the field representatives out there. And with the help of them, you want to extract data from the users. For that, how would you create copies of the main data template file? So the first step is to just open command prompt. So to open the command prompt, what you would do is just type CMD in the search bar here on the top and write just one line of code to create n number of copies of a file. So the file that we would be creating copies of today is the main.excel file. So let's just open it and see how it looks like. So the main.excel file is now open and you see that it is just a basic online purchase request form where you have all the details of the vendor address and so on. So what we want to do is create n number of copies of this file on the Windows machine. So for that, just open the command prompt like we just did and write in this the, the following piece of code. Let's understand what this piece of code does. So it is just creating a for loop and it says that we want to create 10 copies wherein the range starts from one and goes up to 10. It copies the file called as main.excel file and the name of the copies that are being created after the copying process would be file copy one, two, and it goes up till 10. What you have to just do is press enter and it automatically creates 10 copies of the file. Let's see what we have in the folder. So in the same folder, you see that initially you had only the main.excel file, but now you also have 10 files along with the main data template file, which says that you have created 10 copies of the file. Now, these are the files that you would like to use, send it across to the field representatives. And these were, these are the files that they would be using to extract, you know, data from the users. So this is just a very easy process. What just one line of code on the command prompt and you're good to go. So thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button, share it with your friends and stay safe. Thank you. Bye bye.